Okay guys. Okay now let's solve this problem which is uh, how how much does a watch lose per day if its hand coincide every 64 minutes. Now we all know that hands of a clock coincide always in 60 minutes but if it is coinciding in 64 minutes how much of the time it will lose per day. Right? It's a kind of interesting question. Now let's say here uh, it's all about let's say so so normally if it is coinciding if its hand is coinciding every 64 minutes then then what are the spaces that is that is covered in 60 minutes right because normally in 60 minutes they cover uh, the spaces covered in 60 minutes is uh, uh, 60 minutes right so so 60 minute spaces covered in 60 minutes that's normal that's normal but in this case what is going on that in 55 minutes because it's uh, it's coinciding in 64 minutes so 5 minutes left so 55 minute spaces will be covered in 60 minutes so in 60 minutes the total space will be covered is 55 minutes right so so normally so so 1 minute spaces will be covered 60 by 55 minutes then if you look at 60 minutes the spaces will be covered in that clock in that clock which is uh, which we are dealing with in this ex exa example uh, is going to be divided by 55 this and this is giving us 65 to the power 5 by 11 something like that so so what is the loss in 64 minutes so the loss in 64 minutes equals to the loss means this total minute that we are getting but in previous time we are getting 64 so ultimately the loss is 16 by 11 minutes right so if this is the loss in 64 minutes so what is going to be the loss in 24 hours because remember this is the loss in 64 minutes right so what is the loss in one minute so loss in one minute will be 64 then loss in uh, 24 hours 16 64 in 24 hour means 24 and multiplied by 60 to convert that hour into minute this is the overall minute and what is going to be the end of it the end of it will be it is going to be if I calculate it correctly 32 then 8 by 11 this is going to be the answer so let us find out here here we get yes this is 32 8 by 11 this is the answer so it will give us 32 then 8 by 11 this is the particular value now the key uh, thing to solve this problem is you need to look for the weather in 60 minute space it, it normally covers 60 minutes but in 55 minute space it covers 60 minutes right uh, and then in one minute what is going to be it and in 60 minutes how long it is going to cover once you understand that thing how long it is going to cover because uh, five minutes are in the distance between them because that's the key point to understand because normal it is giving you the four minutes difference that means after each five minutes they are going to coincide extra so you need to have this extra value once you get the extra value you know normally the normal time for coinciding that is 64 then you ex exclude that 64 value of this uh, this actual value then you get your ideal minutes and then you can get this idea of 24 hours so that's in that's overall uh, the process that's overall uh, the problem or the answer of this problem right so thank you